Hi, I'm Liam from Fowles and welcome to the Home Renovators Auction Preview for Wednesday the 24th of August 2016 at 10am. Well, we've got some unreserved stuff in the start of the auction tomorrow. The beautiful uh, great big sofa there, plus an ottoman, uh, plus an, uh, an eight-seater dining table as well. Uh, some other f little bits of furniture there. So all unreserved, this stuff, really high-end stuff. Uh, looks like it's all probably X-Display, I would say. That would be its story. Uh, down the Right down the back here, I just thought I'd quickly show you this, uh, this great big um, hand carved marble lion. You can see how tall it stands. Uh, passed in around the 6,000 mark last week so I'm going to go at 4,000 next week. Uh, I think I might have some interest at 4,000 because it's worth about 20 grand so uh, if you're interested in something like that make sure you come and check that out. A little bit more unreserved stuff here. We've got some gym equipment. A uh, couple of bits and pieces. What have we got? This one's the uh, recumbent stationary exercise bike and also a stretching machine there. Uh, moving down now we've got some unreserved out door furniture as well. We'll just get those going all for a dollar a piece there, so that'll be good buying. Uh, down through here, some concrete garden ornaments starting around the $20 mark through to about the $50 mark. More unreserved stuff now. We've got some uh, X sample furniture uh, kicking all that away for $1 a shot, so that'll be good buying for somebody. Uh, great big bath again this week. Uh, didn't sell last week, so it's going in again. Probably start the bidding away at $4,000, so that'll be a really good buy for someone. Has been a lot of interest in it this week, so I'm expecting that to sell uh, this coming week. Some complete kitchens have come in uh, for the L shape, you're sort of around that low $2,000 mark uh, and then the larger ones you sort of head up from there so up to about sort of high 3,000s, early 4,000s so it looks like there's a good half a dozen complete kitchens so check the catalogue uh, in tomorrow. A uh, couple of range hoods there, I reckon those ones will be going for about the $50 mark there. We've got some tools some outdoor table there. This outdoor table, I don't, I don't think that's sold so that looks like that's going to go in again. I'll get that running for $250 tomorrow, that's a big table uh, sort of like two metres by three metres. Plenty of mirrors over the back there. Stacks and stacks of these uh, terrazzo vanity stone basins all different shapes and sizes. There would have to be 50 different shapes and sizes. In the shops you're going to be looking at five to six hundred dollars each on these uh, and I'm thinking probably about the mid 100s to uh, the high 100 dollar mark so uh, really really nice buying. There are heaps of heaps of sizes uh, and plenty of them to go around and matching baths as well. I'll show you those in a little bit. Uh, lots of freestanding vanities there. Anything between sort of the low 200s uh, to about the mid 300s on those depending on their size. Spinning around we've got some mattresses there. We've got some queen size uh, double pillow top mattresses there looking around that $400 mark on the queen size and about $450 on the king size. I think there's still plenty of those to go around. Uh, we've got plenty of sinks in tomorrow. They start from about the $30 mark on the sink. So if you're looking for a, a good cheap sink, nice buying. Uh, had a big delivery of blinds in tomorrow. Uh, all kinds of blinds. Venetian blinds, Holland blinds, outdoor blinds. Uh, so there are stacks of different sizes. I'm thinking sort of between probably $10 and $30 bucks they'll go for most of those. Uh, also on this side we've got lots of curtains have come in too, some lots of room maker curtains and again I'm thinking about sort of between 10 and 20 bucks a piece uh, so they'll be nice buying as well. Uh, moving down we've got plenty of toys for the kids here. What else can I see down here? I can see these whipper snippers. Uh, they went through last week, sold quite a few of those, still some left at $15 a shot. Uh, heaters there, uh, we've got some homewares, we've got some cushions there and some irons. Uh, what else have we got? Some other toys for the kids there. Moving down to the cookers, plenty of cooktops in tomorrow. We've got 600 millimeter, 700 millimeter, 900 millimeter, uh, both in gas and electric, so really nice buying there. Uh, moving down now, we've got some outdoor garden ornaments as well. Uh, that'll all be nice and cheap, sort of 10, 20 bucks on most of that stuff. Lots and lots of vanity basins in tomorrow. I would say there would be 200 vanity basins in all around that, um, for these ones, all around that 20 to 30 dollar mark, so they're all to clear those ones. Uh, moving along, a couple of sinks, not too many Frankie sinks in tomorrow. They come with the tap. You're looking about $200 starting bid. I'd say there's about six or seven of those. Uh, plus there is a black tech tonight sink as well. Uh, so the black tech tonight sink you'll probably see uh, sell probably around, I'm not sure about that $400 mark. Moving through now uh, we've got plenty more here we've got uh, some beautiful shower bases all the way up to 1500 mil there. Really nice looking shower bases. Uh, what else have we got down this way? What else can I show you? Uh, we'll shoot across and just have a look 
at some of these baths and mirrors as well. Got some outdoor mirrors there. I've got some ceiling fans, beautiful looking ceiling fans. Uh, I think from memory about that $40 mark on those. That was about the, the money on them. Uh, some toilet suites, beautiful all ceramic toilet suites uh, ranging from about, about the 70 mark through to about the $200 mark. And then have a look at all these beautiful terrazzo stone baths. Absolutely sensational. Uh, ranging from 1500 mil in length to about the 1700 or 1800 mil length all around that $1,200 mark. Really beautiful looking gear there. Uh, over the other side, plenty of lighting as well. Uh, so that'll all be, I reckon all of that will be about the $20 mark. So really good buying. Could be a couple of hundred bucks on some of that stuff in the shops. Uh, so you'll get some really good bargains on the lighting. Uh, and yeah, have a look at those baths. Absolutely beautiful. Little bit of outdoor furniture, few outdoor heaters and things. Uh, they'll all be good buying. There's, there's warranties on all of those outdoor heaters so you can bid with confidence on those. Uh, moving through, having a quick look at the carpet and floor covering auction. Uh, looks like nearly 200 lots in here today. Absolutely beautiful. As usual in the carpet and floor covering auction, you'll save between 60 and 90% off the normal retail prices. Uh, house lots, room lots, uh, full development lots. I can see all the good colours. I can see wool nylon, solution dyed nylon. Uh, really good range in tomorrow. Also, we've got some carpet tiles. I can see some vinyl planks over there. Also, some artificial turf in green and also in the brown colour, looking between sort of $5 and $10 a square metre for the artificial turf. So, uh, that's always good buying. And then down in Michael's Timber and Building Materials auction, looks like he's got about 800 lots in tomorrow. He's furiously setting that up. Uh, he's got structural pine, he's got heaps of decking, heaps of flooring, stacks of bits and pieces through here. What, what else can I see? Uh, doors, floating floors, uh, tiles. So, a really good looking auction. All in all, three fantastic looking auctions. We look forward to seeing you here tomorrow at 10 a.m. Thanks for watching.